Your landlord or agent may charge you a tenancy deposit when you sign your tenancy agreement. This deposit is to be used for any unpaid rent or damage to the property at the end of your tenancy. The landlord should place your deposit within a government approved deposit protection scheme within 30 days of you giving the deposit to them. They should then give you information about the scheme they've chosen. Only ever hand over money once you've been to view the property and read through the tenancy agreement and always make sure you get a receipt for any money that you hand over to them. At the end of your tenancy, your landlord will tell the scheme how much deposit they think they should give back to you. You'll then have the choice. You can either accept this amount or you can dispute it through the deposit protection scheme. If you and your landlord continue to disagree, then the alternative dispute resolution process can be started via the protection scheme. This considers evidence on both sides and then makes a final decision. If there's no disagreement between you and your landlord, then you should receive your money back within 10 days of the agreement. If your landlord doesn't put your deposit within a scheme or fails to give you information about the scheme within 30 days of you giving it to them, then you can apply to the county court for your deposit to be protected or returned to you. The courts can also award you compensation of one to three times the amount of your deposits.